Hey yo, what's going on Sammy Nation? It's Sammy here and welcome back to a brand new video where today I'm going to be showing you guys the ultimate beginner layout in Retail Tycoon 2. Now before we get into the video, make sure you guys smash like and subscribe with the notification bell turned on so you never miss another brand new video on the channel. And as you can see, I am on a fresh save here and um, yeah, I'm going to be showing it to you guys in this video. So stay tuned and um yeah i hope you'll enjoy this layout now a few notes before we get into it at the start since we are using a manager the um the start will be slow you'll go into the negatives a little bit but over time your money will increase and in roughly less than like 10 hours i made 177k but that was with a bit of extra things too now i kind of disconnected midway through so i don't really know the exact time but the first thing we're going to go ahead and do is sell a lot of this stuff here so this is all stuff we don't need and it's just a lot of extra cash and um yeah, just delete all of this stuff here and you'll get a lot of money back from it so even delete this road <laughs> if you can i mean for some reason it's not letting me delete the road there you go and as you can see we're on 15k and you want to sell this tree in the background as well because that's extra 500 dollars which is actually quite a lot and the next thing we're going to do is we're going to delete this roof right here and um just extend it back around now these mini walls are worth quite a lot of money too so if you can delete them that'll get you up to like 18k maybe 17k and as you can see we already have uh 16.7k to do our shop but we're not finished there we need to go to walls and extend walls throughout all of here and um as you can see we're getting money back from this because the doors and stuff are so expensive so we have nearly 20k to customize our store if you guys want to follow what i do so i'm going to get a glass slidey door and place it right here that seems like a good spot for it then we're going to go to customer service get a checkout and place it right here make sure the green arrow is facing into it like that now the next thing i'm going to go to do is um go to shelving and place seven shelves just all around the store so copy what i do so just like this three right there another three right here and then we can also place one here if you like let's just real quick move that one now we have lots and lots of space too now the next thing we're going to do is we're going to get a clothing rack or two of them at least two clothing racks works best because you need pants and clothing but yeah guys we still have fourteen thousand, which is a lot but we're kind of going to blow half of that on these thing right here so we need to go to infrastructure and select a parking lot and just place another three of them so then we have four in total and then at the back of the store we're going to place a manager's desk because the manager doesn't need to be seen but now what we're going to do is we're going to go to um stock shelves and we're going to assign each of these shelves one thing so uh, we're going to use canned food and toys so um you want to click each image of the canned food and then the shelf so you should have beans soup canned fruit and canned veggies and then you want to go to the other side now and just select all three of these as toys so quadcopters rc trucks and toy rockets and then obviously for clothing you want to do clothing just shirts and pants like that and you'll be good but yeah now what we need to do is we need to go to workers just here and click managers hire new restockers hire new and um cashier hire new oh that's really cool i didn't know you could like actually change the worker that's cool we're still closed for now and we need to wait for our restock to actually restock everything so um that way people have stuff to buy as soon as they come in here and yeah this is going good guys so as i said at the beginning of the video you will notice that you drop into the negatives quite a lot at the beginning but um that should be totally fine because you're gonna make it back eventually you just need to sit afk for a while you don't necessarily have to sit afk you can go on tiktok you can watch youtube you can do anything just as long as you're like auto clicking on the game now i do have an auto clicker in the description if you want to use that i use it a lot and i've been using it for a couple years now it's really good and it's simple to use so i do recommend you check it out if you don't have an auto clicker if you do have an auto clicker that's fine but for those who don't then you probably should check it out because it will help you i'd just like to say that um whilst making the thumbnail of this video i've actually managed to acquire nearly ten thousand dollars and i don't know that took about 20 30 minutes you can probably tell that this is making us absolute bank and my other save actually has um made 177k in not even that long so yeah this setup is really really good 
and you'll make your money back quickly as i said you will start negatives but you will slowly get your money back but um, yeah now we can open our sort because our restocker doesn't have anything to restock anymore because we ran out of money but as you see um every car carries one to six people so we have four parking lots here which means we have a potential 24 people in our store at a time just browsing through things buying things and as you can see everything is going on this guy wants a bunch of vegetables which i don't have now once you get like really rich what you can do is actually um buy some vegetable racks now vegetables are pretty good because people buy loads of them and they're really cheap to supply and they sell for 22 which is pretty good yeah try not to get like too attached to your money and start buying stuff because you will drop into the negatives because your manager will need to buy stuff so try not to buy stuff just keep it as this now what you can do is you can go to store inventory yourself and ooh, you can automatically buy stuff now you want to select instant delivery you must do that otherwise you can't get it because you don't have a truck i mean you do have a truck but you don't have the area for the truck so you need to kind of be careful with that that's what i did in a previous recording of this and it messed me up terribly because i lost like 600 dollars now i'm not sure the exact rates of um cash income but i know it's pretty good and yet we will pretty much always have customers in line just giving us money so our manager can restock and once you've restocked fully like all of these shelves you can see um they're not full to the brim once they're full to the brim that is when the um profits will start coming through because obviously we're gonna have to buy a lot less cans of beans and stuff so a lot less of our money is going to drop all right let's let's do some shopping so I'm gonna buy a nice white t-shirt and some blue jeans. That seems pretty cool. Why is this line so long? Oh my god. I should probably add another cash register. I need to add another cash register in this store. So bad. Hurry up. You look like a prison inmate. Go back to prison. Alright. This please. Alright, thanks. Oh, what a drift. <laughs> Did you guys see that drift? Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. That was terrible. Whoa, whoa, I wait. We need to go check out this store. This store looks crazy. Oh my god. Wow. Diddly Squat Farm Shop. I love this place already. Uh, unfortunately, there's nothing in it. But there's escalators. Oh my god. I feel like I'm in a shopping mall right now. This is this is actually really, really cool. Sorry if you guys can hear a plane in the background. Don't really know what's going on with that. Yeah? Oh, there's so much clothing in here. I love this place. I love this place. But anyway, guys, that was it for this video. If you enjoyed, please remember to smash like down below. Let's see if you can hear. I don't know. This is a different type of video. I'm going to aim for 10 likes only. I know it's a mini like goal, but I think you guys should be able to do it. And, um, yeah, that was my last words ever. Because I just cracked my head open. But remember to subscribe to the notification bell turn on so you never miss any other brand new video on the channel i'd really really appreciate that and if you could join my discord server too that would be great as well but yeah i really really hope you enjoyed and found this helpful and um yeah i'll catch you in the next one guys peace out